Today I'm going to show you how to produce these beautiful and super cute Pusheen nail art nails. Don't worry if you don't have exactly the same colours, you can use whatever you like or there will be links in the description of where you can purchase the products that I've used. After filing and performing cuticle work, apply base coat to all 10 nails and allow to dry. Now it's time to go in with our base colour, I'm using Nails Ink Soho Lane. Take your time and apply your first coat nice and neatly. Once you've applied to all 10 nails, go in and apply your second coat. Allow to dry. I decided to add a little sparkle to this design, so I used Starily Eclipse over my colour coat. Just one layer to all 10 nails. Now we're ready to start painting Pusheen. For this I'm going to be using CND Vinylux in Field Fox. Decant a little onto a tile or a plastic back pad, and then taking a fine detail brush, begin by painting the top of Pusheen's head and her ears. To paint her head, just do a little line and then a triangle on each side of the line for her ears. Do a soft curved line down the side of the nail for her face and body. On the other side, do a little line which we're going to join up when we draw her back across our ring finger and do that with a nice deep curve right the way round to the bottom of the nail. Now using the colour on the actual nail brush, fill in the design where you've already drawn your lines. Now we're ready to start our detailing, take a white polish and we're going to paint Pusheen to Unicorn Horn. We just do this by doing a very very deep V shape and join it up at the bottom. To make our cute thought bubble, use a dotting tool with the white polish again and just pat dots onto the nail and join them up in a sort of circle shape and fill in the centre. Using a smaller dotting tool or a cocktail stick, Draw some more little thought bubbles to join up with Pusheen's head. Now we're ready to paint Pusheen's stripes. I'm using CND Vinylux in Asphalt and I'm going to add this to the Field Fox colour that I used on Pusheen's body and mix them up to get a really nice colour. Then using a fine detail nail art brush or a dotting tool, apply a stripe to Pusheen's head. Apply another two to Pusheen's back. Now we're ready to paint that gorgeous unicorn mane and tail. I'm starting with CND Vinylux in Creekside. You might find it easier to turn your hand around the other way to paint this design like I have. And we're just going to start by drawing a line up from the horn, across around the ears and across the back of the body. Continuing with the mane and the tail, I'm using OPI's Look at My Bow. And exactly the same as last time, just use a fine detail brush or a dotting tool to draw a line that meets up with the blue. Extend this onto the little finger where we're going to be doing that beautiful tail. Next I'm using CND Vinylux in Sun Bleached to add some more detail. Thank you. 
Using Essie's DJ Play That Song, I'm going to add a bit more detail to the tail. The final colour I'm using on the tail is OPI Gelato On My Mind. This is a beautiful sort of duck egg mint green colour. Using a dotting tool in your pink polish, make a love heart. You can do this by making a little V-shape with the polish on the dotting tool and it joins up to make a gorgeous cute little heart. Now we're ready to start the outline. I'm using All That Jazz in Bang The Drums and using a fine detail nail art brush, outline around the shape of Pusheen that you've created. Then outline around the mane and the tail. You can use this step to disguise any bits that might not be quite as detailed as you would have liked or any bits where you've made a little bit of a mistake. To make Pusheen's eyes, using a dotting tool or cocktail stick, apply the same colour that you used to outline. The eyes need to go just below where the centre of the ears are. Then using a fine dotting tool and the same colour again, do two little back-to-back -back curved lines to make the nose. If you want to, you can use a fine detail nail art brush and outline your thought bubble too. Finally, finish off the design with some little whiskers for Pusheen. And then using OPI's matte top coat, apply a very generous amount onto the nails to top coat them all. It's best to apply quite a bit to stop the design from streaking. Once you've applied your top coat to all 10 nails, allow to dry. I'm then going to go in with my Nail Zinc Vitamin E oil pen and apply to the skin around the nails and then gently massage in. Here's the finished design and how cute are these nails? I'm absolutely in love with these. You can use the methods I've taught in this video to paint any Pusheen designs that you like. Let me know how you get on. Thank you very much for watching and please don't forget to subscribe.